This feature upgrade, which is known as the Elite Sniper, was actually buffed in the most recent update to the 3.1 inside of BT Battles 2. Which is why for today's vid, we're gonna see how good is it now since I know the Sniper Monkey did receive a buff. Well, it's only a small buff from the Elite Sniper. It's just only the fit tier middle path that it did receive a buff in it. So if you guys are new to my channel, if you guys want to see more content like this, Make sure you sub and also smash the like button if you have not already. But without further ado, let's just jump right into today's video. And by the way too guys, if you guys are planning to buy some stuff, you know what to do. Go to the bottom right on the creator support and enter my code KevinGaming in the Battles 2 shop because that helps me out very, very much here. So if you guys do use my code, thank you guys for all the support. But now that ad break is over, let's jump into a game. Alright, here we go ladies and gents. We got this map Oasis and we're going to be using Captain Churchill, Dart, Sniper, and Ninja. So we're going to be starting by going for the good old Dart Monkey on the back here. So let's go ahead and do that. Get up to the spike of pole. And this guy will be going for the Engineer, which is going to be his first tower. Very interesting start that this guy will be using. Um, but we're going to try to go for Captain Churchill on round 2. Because I know I was going to go for Captain Churchill on round 1. But I guess we're just going to go for round 2 instead of going for round 1 here. But I decided to place down the good old Dart Monkey here. Because I do wanted to try to make sure that we do want to play a little bit safer during the ramp in here. Because I just want to see if we could try to make sure that we do want to take it late. Hopefully we could probably still make sure that we have a lot ton of the better stray here. Um, so because of that we're going to go for the for captain churchill on round one also i need to start um getting my income back okay there we go get that up but if you guys already know that our goal for today's video is we are going to showcase the newly buffed for the sniper monkey which was buffed in a 3.1 recent update in btd battles 2 i mean it's just only the fifth tier elite sniper so if you guys don't know what they did to the elite sniper i will go over these changes here so what they did is the x5x elite sniper ability no longer has an initial cooldown and they said in a previous update would distinguish the tier 5 ability from the tier 4 ability we had a slight effect of of introducing an initial cooldown for the tier 5. We have removed this cooldown so that like before the cooldown will remains for unchanged when upgraded to the tier 4 and tier 5. So yeah they decided to remove the cooldown for the elite sniper when you are about to afford it because the last time where you actually tried to um somehow afford the elite sniper like for example if you wanted to somehow afford the for the elite sniper potential because in the last previous update they decided to buff the supply drop plus with the elite sniper but apparently if you rather go for the for the supply drop upgrade there is initial cooldown that you could somehow wait it until like 15 seconds but if you rather go for the elite sniper if you want to save up to go for the ability there is a cooldown where you actually afford the for the elite sniper which is really doesn't even make sense like i don't know why they decided to do this but i'm glad they decided to remove it which is pretty good news to see so i hope you guys are happy about this changes here for the elite sniper because i'm not too sure why the heck ninja kiwi did this last time but it's a good thing they decided to remove the cooldowns in it also this guy has the wizard and also i forgot to this hero is actually adora so i'm not too sure what his strategy that this guy will be using because he's going for the ng Plus with the wizard, I'm not even sure this guy has super monkey, which is going to be my only way. Um, I gotta go for a sniper monkey like ASAP, since we don't want to somehow get rushed from the all-out counter. Because I know, in the matter of case, that this guy might send me like a counter. I'm not even sure he might send me wisdom zebras along with purples over the top. If he does, then we gotta be really careful against anything that we're gonna have. So, let's go ahead and get that up as of right now. And let's see if we do somehow get rushed from it. Because I know we got Captain Churchill ability back like in a couple of rounds ago but i just have to be sure that we need to go for the for the supply draw like very very shortly time but we're gonna wait it out until this guy sent me a rush here and this guy did not send me any uh space rainbows on round 12 which is really weird to see like i'm not too sure why um maybe he's saving up to go for the gigantic rush like i'm not even sure if he's saving up but hopefully we don't end up somehow get rushed from my opponent. Because if he does, then I gotta start prepared to go for a lot ton of defense here. If that will be quite fine for me. Oh, this guy has Sniper Monkey. So, NG, Wizard, and Sniper. Okay, I'm not too sure what the heck is that strategy. But why do you bring out the Adora instead of bring out the Super Monkey? That is a good question. Since I know everybody in this game decided to bring out the good old strategies. Except they didn't bring out Super Monkey along with using Adora. Like, I'm not too sure why they didn't bring out the 
the good old super monkey with of dar in it also my eco is kind of a bit terrible here so i do need to go for a supply drop like asap so hopefully we do need to get up to the position here because i know with the supply drop upgrade we could probably just get like 2k per money from the supply crate um so i do need to make sure that we do need to save it to get that up if we do somehow get rushed from it then i will have to go for this upgrade to the sharpshooters all the way here um all right i'm gonna sell you get that up don't forget it's 15 seconds for the cooldown to able to come back from the supply drop so we do need to make sure that we have to go for the good old crossbow all the way if you decide to send me with some rushes like a bfb maybe a zmg or so then i just have to start prepared to go for the defense here like no matter what's going to be but we'll use the supply drop ability like right about now and yeah we're gonna see how this is going to work because i know this map is going to be pretty brutal because i know in the early rounds it's literally hard to able to stall the rounds for longer because i know the map will waste this you could probably just place on the captain churchill like right here because again this hero will probably shoot the straight lines of it it's going to be pretty insanely hard to able to somehow stall the rounds for longer here which is definitely not the best way to do this in the map oasis but i guess that makes sense as i know this map is going to be brutal against that oh bfb oh okay so let me see if we do save it to go for the super monkey fan club hopefully we do need to save that up before we don't want to somehow die to the sets um let me see if i could go for um go for the super monkey fan club hopefully we do have enough money just able to be sure of it um okay also what the heck oh it's on first okay i'm about to set this up to um to first on the sniper monkey all right there we go with that use the super monkey fan club and hopefully we should be good because i'm about to use the level three ability for captain churchill um looks like we are going to be fine all right so i think i'm gonna sell this so we could go for the elite sniper also oh i kind of a bit dark short off what the heck Okay, let's go ahead and get that up. And yeah, you guys can see the cooldown. Basically, they removed the cooldown for the Elite Sniper, which is very, very happy to see. Holy freaking cow. I'm kind of happy that they decided to remove the cooldown because the last update, I have no idea why Ninja Kiwi decided to add a cooldown to, to the Elite Sniper. After you for the Elite Sniper all the way from the Supply Drop, that was pretty annoying to me. Now, the main part is we had to go for this upgrade to the to the main mob against any DDTs here. So, let me see if we do need to go for right about now. And I need to cross path it with the camel in it. So, let's see if we do go for that right about now. Just be sure. And I gotta start prepared to go for a lot on the defense here. If that will be quite fine for me. Because I know we've been slacking. Trying to get so much defense here with only dart monkeys. Plus, we need to get a super monkey fan club for the BFE counters. But I guess that makes sense as I know I need to somehow defend like all out counters here to be honest. Also for round 26, I'm not sure how exactly are we going to defend that rush here. Because I do need to save it to go for the for the crossbow master or go for the U jump. Because if there's a tight ceramic rush going on then oh something with oh DDT's inside. Um I'll sab it just to just to be safe. I'll go for the sticky by the way. I'll use my ability, and I know my sniper farms are definitely hot garbage, I know. Um, but I'm gonna have to sell you once again, just to, um, time this. Okay, we're fine, but I need to go for the crossbow master, like, right now, actually. So, uh, let's go ahead and use the sniper ability. Hopefully, we don't end up dying like this, because I need to get that up all the way. Um, alright, I'm going for the crossbow right about now. There we go with the crossbow, and I'm gonna rebind myself to go for the sabo once again and he sent me with fast cooldown ddt's here okay um looks like we're gonna be fine here it says i know we don't want to somehow die like this with the with the ai or the balloon sense so we do need to make sure we have to time it correctly here all right i'll use that right about now captain churchill ability to save the day um okay Okay, it's already popped. I'll um, use my tower boost. Sabo. Okay, we're fine. Okay, <laughs> that was such a bad play. I know, but we need to be careful against BADs here. Like, I am not kidding, man. This is going to be pretty much difficult to defend that BADs along with using the strategy with no sniper farm potential here. So, literally, this is going to be pretty insanely hard to be able to get so much sniper farms because sniper farms, guys, are definitely the most important thing of all. So I just have to be sure that I need to start prepared to go for a lot of ton of them straight here. I'm not too sure how many dart monkeys that I need to get. Because I have a little bit of a ton of the dart monkeys all the way. So 
this might be pretty difficult. It's something with Tizium G's. Um, okay, I'll use, uh, once again with Sabo. Oh, is he gonna all out of me? Oh, I think he is. Okay, I'll use the ability once again. And I'm gonna try to, um, I'm gonna have to sell everything. I need to go for the end bomber, actually. So, let's go ahead and get that. He's gonna use the ball line ability from the Adora. Makes sense. I'll keep building a couple more Shinobis all the way. Get up to the times 10. Um, I don't think we're not gonna go for the Plasma Monkey Fan Club. Like, I don't think this is going to be possible to afford the Plasma Monkey Fan Club. But, I'm assuming that is a no for sure. But, I think we are definitely going to defend it 100%. So, I'll use the ability from my Sabo. Also, this guy might be dead to the AI. He's dead to the AI. Yup, he died to the AI. <laughs> oh my goodness, man. Always players decide to die to the AI like this. I know those games are definitely not a tense of all, but I guess we will probably take that for the content. Since I know you guys know that Elite Sniper is actually good since they decide to remove the cooldown from the ability. So I'm very happy to see the good old sniper buff. But I hope you guys are happy about the sniper buff changes because the Elite Sniper changes are definitely the best way to see. But I guess that will be a GG in my book here. So we'll take that for sure here. Bam, I'm going to call it for today's video. So I hope you guys do enjoy this. If you guys have not sub, please subscribe and also smash the like button if you enjoyed today's video. And I will see you guys in the next one. And peace everybody.